Good day, friends. It is me, HL Mod Tech, and I am back with another episode of Tinkercad TV. So let's get cracking. Now, friends, the goal of every episode of Tinkercad TV is to entertain and inspire. Today's design is pretty epic, so let me show you what we got. Friends, today we have got a fantastic MiG-21 from Planetastic. Oh my goodness, check this out. Friends, I want to show you just how cool this looks when it loads. Check out all the parts. It is so fun to see all those cuts as this sweet jet comes together. As you can tell from that quick render, it is totally built in Tinkercad. Let's take a look at all the cool parts that are added. All right, friends, as we peek around this cool thing, let's ungroup some parts and check it out. So there's ungroup number one, ungroup number two. Now we've got just the middle so I can take this canopy. Let's do T for transparent and check out that. That is awesome. You can see it goes all the way back. I love the way all these parts are being combined. You notice that cut out all of the lines. I'm going to do control Z to bring those back. And those lines added back in there. That is absolutely fantastic. As we spin around the back, love the horizontal stabilizer, also the vertical stabilizer. It's just so many cool little details. And then what we got going on back here with the engine and the thrust is bonkers. This effect right here is done with T for transparency. Oh my gosh, having those rings inside it, that is such a cool technique. Planet Tastic spent about 8 hours and has 323 parts in this awesome rendition of the MiG-21. It was created entirely on a Chromebook and has 323 parts. That's wicked. Friends, we do have an added bonus. Planetastic has shared a second file that you can copy and tinker. Check it out. These parts are all available so you can add them to your very own planes. Of course, when you come out here, make sure that you give them a reaction. And these links will be in the properties of this video. Just because I love this feature, I'm going to hit settings and change the background. Let's give it a custom sky blue. Get out here in the blues where we like. I think that is going to be pretty cool. When we click out here, boom, you have got your jet in midair. Oh my gosh, what a sweet creation. And once again, thank you Planetastic for taking time to share. Friends, if you have never made a jet, I do want to remind you that if you visit my profile, HL Mod Tech, of course, there will be a link in the properties of this video. You can find a absolute beginner jet tutorial. The link will be right here. And once again, reactions are appreciated. If you want something a little more intense, check out the sweet F-22 Raptor. Of course, there is a tutorial and rendering steps in the properties. Friends, remember in Tinkercad, if you ever make something awesome, like say you complete my F1 car tutorial, if you make an epic version, you can share it with me so easily. You click this button, generate a link, copy that link, and you can reach out and share it with me. I am HL Mod Tech on Facebook, Instagram, Gmail, and TikTok. You can also find me on Twitter. I am HL Tinkercad. If those options don't work for you, don't forget you can also visit my website, hlmodtech.com. I have got a page dedicated to Tinkercad with tons of awesome categories, and below that, lessons for absolute beginners. And extra bonus friends is down here, I have got a sweet built-in messaging tool. You can click that button, add your question, comment, or share link, and reach me almost instantly. Friends, I do also want to recommend the Tinkercad Community Discord. As you can see, we've got more than 700 members, and it is a fantastic place to talk everything Tinkercad. Finally, friends, don't forget we have a link to the Designer Showcase. This is a designer directory with tons of amazing designers. When you click on the user's profile, you can see all of their amazing designs. Of course, if it's one of my designs, there is likely a tutorial at the top. It also makes my day if you take time to give it a reaction. I do, of course, also want to remind you that it is super cool to sort by recent so you can see what the users have been creating lately. Finally, friends, don't forget if you click up here on the gallery, you can see the latest staff favorites and then finally 
click on recent to see what people are making right now of course if you think something is amazing make sure you click on it and give it a reaction friends as i wrap up this episode of tinkercad tv i just want to say thanks again to planetastic designs oh my gosh epic creation and thank you so much for sharing finally friends of course if you enjoyed the video please give it a like please also hit that share button so more people can learn about hl mod tech of course friends you absolutely make my day if you take time to leave a comment down below and if you haven't subscribed yet what are you waiting for smash that subscribe button and last but not least hit that notification bell if you want to be the first to know when there's a brand new video from me hl mod tech thanks for watching have a great day